give him the lowdown yet? Uh, I can give him the basic, you know, five people are trapped in a hotel. You're all puzzles by it, you create less than a robotic person. Okay. Yeah, new characters named Ink. Uh, woke up in the same room with a girl named Aether. Uh, the other three are Ray, Beth, and Reason. Oh, yeah. This, this, this chat. This chat. Oh, I started recording, by the way. Okay. Oh, alright. So, who is Zach gonna be? Um, Henry. well, H Henry is still, oh. um... <clears throat> Let me get my voice ready. <clears throat> <laughs> Didn't go something like, whoa, what's up? It wasn't it like that. Um... Yeah. <laughs> that sounds right. I think something like that. Uh, <clears throat> what happened to me? Is that? Uh, yeah, that was, yeah, that okay. was it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright. The same question repeated itself endlessly in Ink's head. It had been less than an hour since Ink had woken up in the Four Elements Hotel. Since then, he had been acquainted. Eh, he had been acquainted with a handful of strangers who, like him, had no idea why they were there. To add to the confusion, Ink's phone had been stolen. In its place was a PDA which could only contact his friend and colleague, Sean. SEAN! <laughs> the one who had woken him up was a girl named Aether. Right now, she was doing her best to keep Ink's blood loss to a minimum after a violent episode of sudden hemorrhaging. Jeez. <laughs> e enough. I think it stopped for good. I mean... For now. Whoa. How are you doing? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Victory. I could be worse, considering. Thanks for helping me keep that under control. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> that was real quiet. Yeah, I cut. It's all yeah. mumbled. That kind of bleeding isn't normal, is it? No, I've never experienced anything like that in my life. Say, how do I look? Do I look buff? <laughs> Most of the blood landed on the wall on floor. You wiped away what was on your face, so you look okay. Got a bit on the floor, but you might be able to wash that out. Huh. Ink gave his scarf a quick twist hiding the tiny bloodstains from view. Cool. Don't mention it. This, yeah. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna do take two on that one. Cool. <laughs> Don't mention this to anyone, alright? Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate it. What? That. Why not? You be serious. Yeah, look at, look at her eyes. Look at her staring directly into our souls with her yellow-colored eye. Like, what is that? And she's covering herself up with her snuggie or whatever that is. <laughs> this seems this seems like kind of the kind of thing that can make people panic, you know? Until we know what's going on <laughs> Until we know what's going on, let's keep this on the down low. That little didn't know made me laugh. I'm sorry. I'll worry about my personal health once I've made it home. Besides, I feel better now. Triple done. Don't look at me like that, I'll be fine. What makes you so sure? I'm the detective, remember? You can't kill off the detective before he solves any mysteries. Am I right? This isn't a story. Story of life, come on. Life's a kind of story, no? <laughs> me, I said that. Call me. Yes. Promise me you'll go for a check and let me get back. Deal. Let's get out of here then. It wasn't an act. Ink did feel better. Whatever his affliction was, it had passed. I won't be able to give medical attention until I get out of here anyway. Grabbing Ink by the wrist, Aether dragged him through the one slot double doors at the end of the hall. Ooh! On the other side was a small lounge. To Ink's surprise, his other new acquaintances were scattered about the room. 
quiet and grave they were keeping to themselves. You guys are still here? That's you, Zach. Uh, wait, well, how do you pronounce that? Ray? Ray. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Doors locked. Huh? Door over there, opposite from the one you just came through. It wouldn't budge when I tried to open it. It's just like... Did you finish? Because I, I didn't hear you. Yeah. Oh yeah, my mic probably cut out. It's just like that last room. There aren't any other exits? Do you really think we'd still be here if there were any other way out? <laughs> That's my voice for this person, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Very good. I almost forgot about that. So what? We're just supposed to wait here? We aren't in a position to do anything. You have a very interesting bath. I feel like you need a more old woman-y voice. I can't sound old. Wait, no. I'm in a position to do anything else. That was just high pitch. Yeah, that, that's almost my I voice for the other person. What do sound like? Ah, it's just like, do, like, think of an old man. Like, ah! <laughs> like that. But then, then put it high pitched. We aren't in a position to do anything else. You're just German now. <laughs> we aren't in a position to do anything else. We aren't in a position to do anything else. No, just don't, don't you do your regular voice. Well, can anybody do an old woman sound? No. <laughs> Chris is on the scene. He's gonna lose so, his voice again. Yeah, I know. I don't feel like it. I'm too tired for this garbage. Oh, fine. At least just oh, make your voice high pitched. Woman... Just make just make your voice. Can I sound like a witch? Is that like good? Hi. I mean, if you're not sure. We acting up. No, that's really bad. <laughs> put it high pitch, just put it high pitch, put it high pitch. Come on, popsicle, big boy. Just do that then. If yeah. that's the best. We yeah. aren't in a position to do anything else. Honestly, that was that was yeah. I don't like this. I want out. I'm not a bee. Please have a seat for the bee. Let's try to be patient. Beth lowered her head and grew quiet. Ink slumped into the nearest seat. Okay. You're clicking off the screen. <laughs> From here, he had a good view of the wall mounted screen. <laughs> There's another one? <gasps> Happy face! So now what? I did that really quickly. Nobody answered. The others were either fiddling with the, the devices they had had been given, or staring at the wall, ink side. Huh. <laughs> Not a real social bunch, are they? Well, whatever. I guess we'll just wait for the... For, mm, I guess we just wait for that face thing to show up. We're not professionals. Yeah. I was fine Hello. yesterday. As if on cue, the monitor sparked to life. Speak of the devil. Hey, I'm gonna change this duder's voice. I don't know what to. Okay. This message is set to play after a short delay. If any contestants are not present, please retrieve them. Go from Family Guy. I like it. <laughs> Who are you? Why do you talk like that? Why do you look, look like, like, that? like that? Don't make fun of my voice, ma'am. <laughs> please note that this message is a recording and will only play once. It is advisable that you pay attention. Hello, contestants. Long time no see. Look at how happy he is. <laughs> that was a joke, of course. I saw you but moments ago. <laughs> oh, why did no one laugh along with me? I already hate this guy. I love him. Please, sit down. Make yourselves comfortable. Relax. I'm sure you all have questions for me. I ask you to be patient. By the end of my little speech, I imagine that at least a few of your concerns will have been addressed. Let me start by confirming that yes, you have been abducted. And yes, I am the one responsible. Sorry about that. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Scent. Aw, he's got a very interesting name. More like Scent it, am I right? <laughs> uh, 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 up top, buddy. Oh, yeah. Oh. There. there you go. <laughs> Be as brief as I can. Everybody. I'll be
be as brief as I can. I have brought you here today so that you, my enemy, you may play <laughs> a game of my own design. The robot the glitched my... out. <gasps> Roll credits. The name of my game is Exit Corner Slash In Between The Two Exit words. Slash Corners. The rules are simple. I have placed you in the heart of the lovely Four Elements Hotel as a game master. I will do my best to keep you there. If you manage to exit the hotel, you win. If your heart stops beating, you lose. Wait, what? That's all there is to it. Not so difficult to understand. Hmm? Allow me to be clear. In this game, you must put yourself first. Your victory defeat is not tied to that of any other contestant. I have made some alterations to the Four Elements Hotel to allow for a more pleasant gaming experience. We have fiber optic cables for our internet. <laughs> <laughs> One such amelioration is the inclusion of 16 pounds of cocaine, oh. industrial grade <laughs> Semtex, at the, at, the, at, the, at the building foundation. In 24 hours, the aforementioned explosives will detonate. This will cause the entire structure to collapse. In the event, we're still in the building at the time of collapse. We will most likely be crushed and killed, resulting in a loss. Pardon the negativity. But please, do not underestimate me. I want you to escape through the exit. I most certainly do. That's why I've given you all a Gemini, to give you a fighting chance. Each of you have been entrusted with an electronic device that I've dubbed it Gemini. I assume you're already all aware of this fact. Why Gemini, you ask? Each Gemini has a twin. Gemini may only send and receive messages from their twin. The other halves of your Gemini have been left in the care of someone you know. These people will be referred to as your contacts. Right now, as far as any of you are concerned, your contact is the most important person in the world. While your contacts may be different, are all equally important. I guarantee you'll need their help to achieve victory today, so try your best to get along with them. Poor communication kills, you know. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. I suppose I've rambled on long enough, haven't I? I'll leave you alone then. The next puzzle will be available in just a moment. I've got a myriad of challenges lined up for today. I'm rather fond of puzzles anymore. Hopefully my fondness is continuous. <laughs> Adieu, contestants. Good luck. The screen went blank. Ink had endless questions for Sen, but it was clear that he wasn't coming back. What? Hey, if you guys could, could pause, I did not open that window enough. It's not nearly cold enough in here. Alright, I'm gonna check the recording while you, while you do that. <laughs> All right, thirteen minutes in. Questions so far while you know we're taking this break. I have a question about what that noise is that I keep hearing in the audio. It's like the this wind. low rumbling. Off of whose mic? Way off of Chris's, I think. Yeah. It could be like the jazz music in the background. What? No, I think it's like his window blowing. It. Yeah, I hear this like wind noise that's going through, which actually really loud. It's uh, Henry breathing. <laughs> oh, is it? Yes. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? All right. Well, that's why I paused for a long time at one point. I was waiting for you to stop breathing into your mic. I knew you didn't know. I just I didn't know who it was, so I didn't want to pull up Discord oh. and check. Oh. I think I fixed it now. Hopefully. Fixed it. Oh, we all I thought there's like a tornado going through <laughs> someone's room. God, no. It's just unbreathed. Are you guys ready? No. <laughs> Are we actually not ready, though? Oh, I am. I was kidding. I'm ready. Yep. Ink rose to his feet, shaking. A thousand thoughts raced through his head. What was the purpose of exit corners? Sorry, exit slash corners. Who was sent? Was it just bad luck that Ink wound up as a contestant, or was he specifically targeted? <laughs> what the heck's going on, man? Everybody panic. <laughs> I feel like just utmost panic is not what we should be going for. Oh no, go for yeah. that one. Is that guy for real? 
Dude might as well have a curly villain mustache. <laughs> <laughs> it would be different. Darn it. You know, the, uh, if that was easier, if that was easier for you, you could do that one. No, I just forgot. Oh, okay. Like, it's not hard to do the high-pitched one. Uh, kind of like my, uh, Herbert the Pearl. Yeah, I got you. Oh, no, hands, I think. Hey, could you say this line again real fast? We didn't really hear. It would be difficult to twirl with no hands, I think. Dunka. Oh, good point. I'm glad to see you at least taking the... No as well. That yeah, really, cut out again. It all feels kind of surreal, you know? I mean, did someone just tell me that I was going to die? Like, actually? <laughs> He's such a bro. <laughs> He's such a... <laughs> yeah. But, like, like, his art, he doesn't look like a bro at all. I know. <laughs> Aren't you scared at all? I'm more confused than anything, but yeah, of course I'm scared. I think we're all a bit scared, dear. First step in overcoming fear is to understand it. Shut up, William Walter. Is that something they told you in your program? No, I, I, I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just cleaned that up. Still seems like a little bit of advice, right? Don't you think? Maybe we should take some time to make sure we're all in the game. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Good idea. Let's go over what we know. That's okay. Are you both paying attention? This is fun. Yeah, I'm listening. Don't mind me. Oh wait, I thought I thought I thought Ray was gonna talk, my bad. That's Ray, right. Who had been leaning on the wall in silence, rejoined the others. Just as he opened his mouth, a familiar noise emanated from the terminal. Yeah, this Ray is really shady. That's for sure. He said like <laughs> one thing so far this entire time. Yeah, no, no, he's talked before. Trust me, I yeah. have to do his voice. Oh. He's like some elite hacker or something. Honestly. Is Ray the guy with the gray, like, bean, beanie there? Yeah, yeah he, he was the pimp-looking dude. The skater boy. That old woman lies at a manager who doesn't know how to dress herself. Aether is the girl who wears the green hoodie. And Ray. The contestants all turn to face it. It's another puzzle. Harumph. This is you. Uh, yeah, hmm. I guess it was sent to uh, initialize shortly after the message finished playing. Before we get to that, I think we should still do a short re- Right, where should we start? Sent. Why is it in the far right? Is it always like that? No, usually it's like right now. Characters on the right. Right. Is that why you were so deep in thought back there? Yeah, who is he, exactly? He's a big old question mark for me. I can't figure him out. Big ol'. He's the one that brought us here, and if none of us remember anything from before this morning, that makes him the only one who really knows what's going on here now. It's his motive. How was I abducted? Is all this really necessary? Why did he choose me? Why did he choose any of us? That's what concerns me. I love when people ask questions that they know they're not going to get an answer to. Just yeah. keep piling it on. Ink, yeah. you want to have some questions? It's like they know they're on a TV show or whatever. <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine. Although... Although? If we can determine how or why we were chosen, we might be able to figure out who he is. What do you mean by that? If he kidnapped us at random, then Scent is probably just some kind of maniac, right? But if he chose us specifically, then we must he must know us to some degree. He has a Oh come on, I keep forgetting. <laughs> he has a best of my name! So it's not out of the question that he kills victims at Yeah, maybe he's just some nutjob. 
I'm not so sure about that. I'm not saying that Scent knows us all personally, but I don't think he would kidnap people at complete random. I don't think anyone would do that. Seriously? Do you not think that anyone could beat this? Malicious. Alright, that's what I said. Uh, j it just probably didn't pick up, yeah. Oh. Jeez. Ether, I know you're a psych program, but I, I get that, but that doesn't make you an expert on the human psych. Oh, uh, you, I blanked, okay, sorry. Oh. Yeah, I feel like my mic's cutting out or something. Some yeah. people are 100% bad I can't shit. Say that in a, I can't say that in a Christian. No, I'll, I'll, I'll <laughs> say bad shit. Know? Can you actually have not? You... Oh, no. Wowzers. <laughs> You can have big beer in the morning, <laughs> Just like yelling this, alright. Have you listened to the way Sant speaks? Something's wrong with you, that guy. That, um, isn't my name. I think I know what a Aether is trying to say. So much effort went into capturing us and setting everything up, I mean. There are hand scanners and these Gemini devices and the like. Why would someone go through all this trouble to scare the shit out of random people? Isn't there an easier way to do that? Like I said, some people are real messed up. Even still, people like that can get the pattern. You might not know us all personally, but they're probably at least what we Maybe certain criteria? At least one thing that we all have in common, maybe we meet a certain set of criteria. Sorry, I must have cut out. Yeah, I know. I'll just, I'll reread anything that yeah. cuts out. I, I hadn't thought of that. I think he examined each of his fellow contestants one at a time. And as he did, he noticed that they were all glancing around at each other. He let out a weak laugh. <laughs> we don't really have much in common, do we? I mean, we've got both men and women, students and dropouts, young people and uh, er, middle-aged persons. Hey, I'm a fiend. I appreciate if you didn't mince words when our lives could be on the line. And thank you. Oh, jeez, Beth. Snappy. <laughs> yeah, your <laughs> voice keeps getting higher every time. <laughs> It's great. <laughs> uh, anyway, the point is that I don't see anything in common between the five of us. Something less obvious, perhaps? Uh, I'm, I'm gonna assume it's not that. Yeah, I was gonna say that top one. Yeah. Because, like, maybe something online. What do you does have that even a mean? Do you have a Facebook, too? <laughs> <laughs> like, come on. <laughs> Have you used yeah. Google Chrome? Let's do this one. We all live in Bellbridge, right? I know that Aether and I do at the very least. Yeah, I live in Bellbridge, regrettably. What a dish. I'm afraid I don't live there. I've never even heard of Bellbridge. She's got Alzheimer's. <laughs> oh. Well, damn, so much for that idea. Is that where we are right now? Oh, wait, does she actually have Alzheimer's? What is going on? I don't know. I don't remember there being a Fort Elements Hotel anywhere in Belgrade. Of course, I didn't grow up there, so I wouldn't know. I was born there, and I haven't heard of it either. Isn't... Wait, did he say I wasn't? He born was born. There? He was born there, and he's never heard of one there before. So he he you was. You guys born... heard me say this line, or do I have to repeat? No, no, you're good. Yeah. Okay. He was born in the four the four elements. No, he was born no, in no. Belbridge. And he doesn't remember it. Yeah. He was exactly. born in Belbridge. It's a medium-sized college town, East Coast, Jersey Shore. He's close, did you say? Something wrong? I live out west. I would have had to come a long way. Wowzers. Let's try not to worry about it too much. There's no way to know where we are for sure. Let's forget it I, for now, I guess. 
I barely know any of you, so there's no way I'm gonna be able to figure out what ties us all together, if there's anything at all. Whatever his reasons for capturing us, Scent clearly isn't his real name. Come on, man. Your name is Ink, you're dating a girl named Ether, and you don't think that a name like Scent could be legit? Why did he assume they were dating? Because they came out the same room? Yeah, it's, I came out of the same womb as my brother. It doesn't mean we're dating. Come on. Think about it. You also, just beat my logic. <laughs> <laughs> also, sir, it's Aether. We're pronouncing it. Aether? Oh my goodness. A it's elegant. Is that like specific? Um, it's, right. just, it's just what we, we uh, have been doing. Alex and I made an agreement. It is Aether. I'm an Aether man, but I will abide by their pronunciation. You shall abide. All right. Uh, we uh, we're no, not. I'll just leave it at that. Oh. <laughs> Gladly. That's... Oh, oh, that actually worked. I was like, oh, you guys come out of the same room, so I just assumed. Seemed like you knew each other. Bap. The two of you are complete strangers that just happened to wake up in the same room. Same bed, actually. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> that like, face. Like, Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> what if my dad finds out? <laughs> that must have been awkward. I guess Scent thought it would be funny. Why would that be awkward? I mean, they're both fully clothed and unconscious. <laughs> I've got to hand it to him. It's kind of funny. You're sweating buckets right now, but let me do you both a favor and change the subject. Oh, my, my guy is such a character. Cool that, yeah. <laughs> Please. <laughs> why don't we just, why don't we get started on this puzzle? We can chat about scent later. Remember that we've got a time limit. Our lives. Oh, this way. I'd like to add that there's still the possibility that this is just Sense's idea of a joke. There may be no explosives or time limit. Right now, we're just taking his word for it. Lisa, uh, you've been so quiet I almost forgot about you. <laughs> That's because I've been messaging my father instead of standing around chit-chatting. I'm trying to get rescued, not play detective. If you're convinced this whole thing is a joke, then why are you so dead set on getting rescued? I never said that I thought this was a joke, did I? I just said that it was a possibility. Scent has committed a crime in kidnapping us and forcing us to play this game. There's no telling how far he'll go. It's too risky not to take action, even if this is all a big prank. Why did you even suggest it? Well, I don't want to look like an idiot if this is all fake, obviously. Look at what you're wearing. You definitely look stupid. Like, like what? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Ray's the only, like, almost normal looking person. Like, with his Except, clothing. For some reason, his clothing juts inwards right here. Like, how does it I, do that? Yeah, I have no idea. Oh, but, yeah, I guess. And, like, why is the zipper so far away here? Well, I think it's like, to, like, to prevent rain from getting in and, like, if you zip it, like, maybe the other just, bit's hidden. I feel like it's so far, though. Like, this this looks like it barely fits him. There's no way he's zipping this up. Yeah, that's true. I mean, it looks pretty comfortable, though. Yep. Yeah. Do you seriously care that much that what other people think of you? Unlike some people, I actually have an image to maintain. A lot of people expect great things from me, you know. These are pretty big words coming from someone who's probably never worked a day in their life. Guys, come on, not this again. Nah, trust me, he he's relatively cool compared to rid of this chick. Uh, She's kinda snotty. Right. Just look at the clothing <laughs> that zips like what what yeah. Someone messed it up. Wait, hold up. The, the pockets are uneven. Holy crap, oh, yeah. they are. 
They're uneven by what a What did mind. they do? What, is this fashion? Hipsters have gone too far. Hipsters, am I right? Whatever. I'm done talking to this idiot. Lisa, you said you messaged your father. Does that make him your contact? I don't know. I guess so. What exactly did you tell him? I told him that my kidnapper wasn't interested in a ransom. Instead, he's forcing me to play some weird game and threatening to kill me. Did you let him know that there are other people who've been abducted as well? No. Oh, well did you at least tell him that you're in a hotel called the Four Elements and that you've only got 24 hours to find a way out? N no. Then what did you tell him? I told him what I told you. That's it? Yeah, so? She's so ashamed. <laughs> she, looks, she looks like a bird. She not look like a, a bird. bird. Yeah, like her face is like a bird. <laughs> that guy seems to see. It took you five whole minutes to type that out? I'm slow at texting, okay? Give me a blank. She, she would not be the type of person to be slow at texting. Yeah. You're a teenager, shouldn't you be an Olympic level tester? Shut up! Oh, oh wait, that, no wait, that's a right person. Shut yeah. up, both of you! Should we get started on the puzzle? You're wasting a lot of time asking me pointless questions. It's pretty obvious. Yeah, it's pretty obvious she just wants to change the subject. But she's right. We need to push on. Perhaps we should. There's more about this game I'd like to discuss, but we should get to this puzzle out of the way first. Yeet. Five pairs of wary eyes turn to the turn Let's get to it then. Oh baby. Turn seven into hashtag 26. How are we gonna make it into hashtag 26? It's probably like the negatives turn into a 26, you know? Wait, what? Remember the last time where we took the light blocks to make a plus out of the dark blocks? Probably like that again. But how do we make the hashtag? <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bro, this this doesn't seem easy. <laughs> um I forgot how Yeah, just like start moving them around until we can brainstorm them. Oh, okay. These are like not what I thought they were. Okay. Yeah, okay, 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 monka. Monka ass. I'm just I'm just slapping stuff around by the way. Uh, In no particular order. I'm trying to brainstorm. Eat. I should I feel obligated to tell you there are two solutions. One of them is the hashtag. Quick, hashtag it up. Oh. Hmm. I'm gonna make a hashtag. I don't know how to make a hashtag. Wait a minute. Never mind. I just got a. I just got a like weird sense of deja vu for some reason. From the hashtags. The combination you just did. I don't remember. Uh, okay, let me think too. Alright, so try putting like the. Like reaching from the bottom left up to the bottom right above a square block. Uh, oh, jeez, I guess they both do that. Wait, uh, hey. The other triangle. Put that over a square block. Wait, was the number. Over. Did the blocks make it look like a 7 at first? Yeah. yeah something weird like that, okay. yeah. 
Ah, we don't really need to, it's fine. Yeah, I just need that triangle it one just like over to the right. This one? Yeah, just move it over one right block. Oh, wait. Uh. It sits. Isn't that a sits? Or does that not look like sits too? That doesn't look like a six. <laughs> I don't. Uh, might as well check the solution. We have an infinite amount of tracks. That was a surprise. No, I mean, like. Just like the two blocks there look like a sits to me. I don't know why. Um, do you think? Do you think it's a thing that twenty six has a hashtag that seven doesn't? Well, that's what I'm thinking. Like this hashtag is like, what? Are, what are you here for? Maybe it doesn't mean the number seven. I don't know. I mean, uh, does that help us? No. <laughs> I'm, I'm just brainstorming, alright. I also feel obligated to remind you. Ask yeah, I know we can ask others. This sounds lame though, I don't wanna have to ask them. Yeah. Ink's got this un under control. Bro. <laughs> we almost got- yeah, we got the 7 back. <laughs> <laughs> Check solution, huh? We did uh... <laughs> Darn. What if we can make like a percent sign. Percent sign? Uh, yeah, I don't know what that would mean, but yeah, it could <laughs> <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Darn it. Um, I don't really know how to do this. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. Nah, I don't know. No. Oh wait, maybe you're onto something there. Like oh, put Mickey the, Mouse. the the that one go up to, and like can you make what? Oh no. Is it like talking, okay, this is like way out in the middle of nowhere, this is just like some random thing. What is the 26th letter of the alphabet? Oh. Z. Z. Wait. Wait, what if you're big brained? Big brain over here. I don't know how to make a Z though. Like, how am I gonna do that? So it'd be like one. It'd be like it'd a be line like... and then a curve and then another. I. What ones wait, do I use? Wait. All of them. Take the... Wait, I... Can wait. you make like a oh. diagonal line with those four triangles? Can you do that? Uh... I think it was how it was set up and made like a diagonal line. Can you put it like in the middle? Okay, maybe? I guess that works. Oops. How did I... Okay. Yeah. Oh wait, no, that's... Wait, maybe we try making a Z out of the negative space, like not the bright ones, but the dark ones? How do we do that, though? I, I, saw, I saw you do it, I just, like, take, go down one. With this? No, no, not with the... Yeah, click that one, swap it out with the one below it. Oh wait, that's not it. How did you... Oh, and then, like... The one bottom row. No, yeah, that one. And then swap it with the one to the right. Yeah. See, and if like we put the next, the last slash one where that full block is. Right here. No, uh, where the the full like white block. Yeah. See, we made a line out of the empty space. Oh, right there. Yeah, something like that. Seems very difficult. <laughs> I mean, that's what how that last puzzle was solved. That's true. It's really close. That yeah, is. I don't. Maybe put the full block. Yeah, right there. Right there. <laughs> I was just kidding when I did oh, that. Oh, that's what that's what I was thinking. This one's a, like. I feel necessary to remind you, you have the entire thing, all six. Okay. You watch that? We, we have like an entire area to play with, it's pretty much what he was saying. So we gotta do that, that didn't help. <laughs> <laughs> um.
move that like us. yeah like that. Yeah, but we're this back guy. where we started. Yeah, this this little idiot's in the way. It's got bop bop and then bop. But like you're, you're not bop. using the left column at all. That like, is a Z. The second, third, and fourth column. Trying to make it be a bit of all four I'm just going off of what you guys are saying. I have no idea. Just move everything over, why not? Yeah. Move that second slant one on the right like to make the absence base. Yeah there. I moved there. Yeah. Then and wait, then put that pull well, that full block right like one up. Yeah. Yeah, like that. And then and then the top one down one. Yeah, y'all, oh. there we go. We did it. Hey yo. Nice job, gentlemen. Woo. The second Woo. solution you can actually make six of those. Really? Well we were more big brained with our solution. Yeah. Hey, it was wrong. The solution you're supposed to get, not the secret solution. So. I will screw off, buddy. Okay? I wanna feel special. Hey, I was right. Oh, how is that the answer? The number 26 in the clue refers to the letter Z, 26th letter of the alphabet. Turns out you can draw Z if you get crafty with the tiles. <laughs> Alright guys, I probably should have said this like once we got done with the puzzle, but I think I'm gonna head out now. Oh, you gotta head out? Oh. Ain't no That's problem. Sorry, it was probably awkward timing with it, but yeah. Hey, it's fine. I'll yeah, take you're over. Good. All right. Yeah. See you, dude. All right. See you about. Oops, see you guys. <laughs> She's just now. All right. I guess I'll take over, Ray. Oh, okay. Pretty sharp ink. That was certainly harder than the last. Puzzle? <laughs> Congratulations, contestants. That was the correct solution. Before you proceed, I feel like it is my responsibility to issue a warning. The 24-hour limit, while important, should not be your immediate concern. The explosives I planted are far from the most dangerous thing in the hotel. I have refrained from throwing anything harmful at you thus far, but I assure you, safety is temporary. There, I've opened the way. Welcome to Exit Corners. I'm looking forward to watching you all struggle, and you will struggle. Or you could die. That guy's a real piece of work. Why does he look like he's made from the show? People these days are so strange. Paper mache? That's what he reminds you of? You know, it's not really him, right? Just a computer-generated image he's using to keep us from seeing his real face. Same deal with his voice. It's completely synthetic. What do you mean? I worked very hard on that voice. Yeah, you put emotions for each face. Oh, is that so? I'm a run-down hotel, and all these contraptions and creating... I'm no expert, but what these things give us the fortune? That face would be a cinch to make, but as for the rest of it, I see what you're getting at. This isn't within any normal prison person's price range, not prison. If Exit Corners really is the work of a single person, then that person would have to be pretty well off. Razor Mark hit home. A certain redhead soon became the center of everyone's attention. Why are you all staring at me? My father and I are extremely wealthy. Wait, my father and I are extremely wealthy. Did I get that right? Right, because my family is the only entity in the entire world that has any money. Oh, and that must mean I'm a deranged sociopath who locks herself in a hotel with a bunch of strangers in an attempt to get herself killed. I've got to hand it to you, Ray. Your reasoning is flawless. Sarcasm won't do you any good. I'm not saying you're behind all this. Frankly, I don't think you're smart enough. And to be honest, 
I don't think it's within one person's power to run this whole game on their own. But you're definitely hiding something. And I know you are. You've been acting real suspicious all morning. Especially now. What do you mean, suspicious? Something I have Huh? What's wrong with her hand? Every now and again, she makes me feel her gestures with her right hand. Think it looks like she's kind of single. Time man with her. It's... it's just a nervous tick, that's all. It's normal. The shaking in your voice is gonna be otherwise. Ooh. Now we gotta press on. We gotta press no, on. No, I was I, I was thinking the other one. You were thinking this one? Uh, I was I was thinking that one. No, we need her to spit it out, Lisha. We do not need to give her space. She needs to be man. Like... What if she is holding something back, and if spit it out, and then she just goes, Bruh. Like, we need her to sp Dr. Octagon push this, dude. Hey, Alex? I know how it both play out. I can't give you you're advice. Just a, you're just a tiebreaker. I mean... I can't tell you. Spit it out, Lisa. I no, don't, no, just whatever. Just go with effort. Spit it out, Lisa. There's something you're not telling us. How much more obvious can you make it? I've got nothing to hide. You're just imagining things. You're a terrible liar. I'm about as convinced that you're not hiding anything as I am of you being a slow texture. <laughs> How is that so hard to believe? It's the truth, I swear, on my mother's grave. I believe you. Aether? Leave her alone, you guys. She's not going to tell us anything. Ugh, I don't like her. <laughs> Even when she's clearly hiding something? Maybe she's hiding something. Isn't necessarily related to X appointment, though, is it? She's allowed to have some privacy. Isn't she? It'd be different if you had proof that Liza was up to something. No, you're just persistent. looking for someone to blame. I, I guess so. Dang it, Aether! Your lucky ink turns to mush whenever you open your mouth. <laughs> I like the new voice. <laughs> hey, now she, she's right, you know. We're sort of picking on Liza for no good reason. I just wish whatever. I'm done with you, chumps. What a loser. Should we give Ray a moment? No, we are the phone. The only thing we're at liberty to do right now is play in exit corners. You know, the more often I hear exit corners, the stranger it sounds. What's this supposed to mean? I wish I could answer that. I wish I could answer anything. Why? Why were we brought here? Who is sent? Oh, luckily Ink's now asking rhetorical questions. Yeah, it's great. Good start to tell you. And what is Exit Corners? Yeah, I assume that'd be the end. <laughs> yeah, it faded to black. Thank goodness, holy crap, it's doing the bomb, I'm so tired, I'm exhausted. Do you mind going into the password so that way I can like, write it down in the chat, in case it doesn't load up here again? Oh, and Alex, I think I can like, I think I know something that could help it from you cutting <laughs> out. Cutting out. Yeah. Uh, do you want to do it now? Or three ones or two ones after the two? Zero two one 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 zero one one, one zero one two. Zero two one 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 zero one one, one two. two. Okay, I wrote it in the chat. What was that, Henry? Uh, do you wanna fix your, like, audio thingy now, or later? Like, I mean, it's like... Shannon's computer, that's the only reason why I was- Oh, okay. Darn it, Darn Shannon. Shannon. Oh. Alright, well, I'm, I'm gonna stop the recording here, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for watching, Matt, cause I know- <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, really. Yes. Thanks, Matt. <laughs> Thanks, man. We do appreciate the feedback. Maybe you will join us, maybe? 
we'll, nah. we'll we'll see. We'll catch you in the next episode. Am I right, gentlemen? Yeah. Peace out. Peace out.